आज ही डाउटनेट ऐप डाउनलोड करें डाउटनेट पर होगा अब आपके सभी मैथ्स केमिस्ट्री फिजिक्स और बायोलॉजी डाउट का सफाया बस अपने क्वेश्चन की फोटो खींचो उसे क्रॉप करो और तुरंत वीडियो सोल्यूशन पाओ डाउनलोड नाउ इन द क्वेश्चन वीव बिन आस्ट टू टेक वन फ्लॉर ईट फ्रॉम द फैमिलीज फेबेसी एंड सोलेनेसी we have to write its description and draw its floral diagram after studying it so we all know when we talk about uh, angiosperms or flowering plants they are a group in our plant kingdom in which the process of sexual reproduction is accomplished with the help of a specialized unit called flower and uh, since angiosperms are a very diversified a very big group they have been further classified into many families in which the morphology of the flower as well as the entire plant varies greatly so we have been given these two families which are very well known fabaceae is also known as the pea family or the leguminous plants all the pulses they are found in this family whereas solanaceae is our potato family so again many economically important crops and uh, even medicinal and ornamental plants are found in it so here we have to describe the morphology of uh, one particular flower from each of these families so from fabaceae family since it's called pea family we'll take the example of uh, garden pea or pisum sativum flower itself when we set out to describe the flower what we first see is that it is a bisexual flower both male and female sex organs are found in the uh, flower and if we look at its symmetry the symmetry is zygomorphic whereas when we talk about the potato family let's take the example of solanum nigrum that is the flower of the makoi plant here also when we see the flower we find it to be bisexual that is uh, male and female both type of reproductive parts are found in a single flower but its symmetry is different it's actinomorphic so when we are describing any flower a flower mainly has four whorls the outermost of which is the whorl of the sepals after this we have the petals inside the whorl of the petals we have the essential whorls which contain the stamens that is the male sex organs and after this the whorl of the carpels that is the female sex organs so all of these four whorls are found in either of the flowers which we are taking here in our pea flower although both of the flowers are bisexual that is the common thing among them but in the pea flower we are finding symmetry to be zygomorphic that is bilateral type of symmetry will be seen here but in the potato family we are finding actinomorphic flowers that is they will show radial symmetry now when we come to the different plant parts how do we describe both of these plants in case of the pea plant we find five sepals which are fused together and similar condition will be seen in our solanum plant also there will be five sepals in the flower which are fused together that is gamosepalous condition after this when we come to the petals in case of our pea plant we have unique type of estivation in the petals we see one plus two plus two arrangement where this is our single posterior petal after this two standard petals which are lateral and anteriorly we have these two petals which have been fused to form a keel so this vexillary kind of estivation of the petals is found in our pea family plants however in our potato family we will have five petals with valvate estivation that is they are going to touch each other but not overlap after this when we talk about uh, the androecium or the stamens in case of our pea plant we will see that there are total 10 stamens but they are in 9 plus 1 condition that is diadelphous condition total there are 10 but they are in the form of two bundles nine are forming one bundle and one is separate whereas in our solanum flower we will find five stamens which are attached to the petals so epipetalous stamens are going to be there and here petals were also fused together after this when we come to the gynoecium in case of our pea plant we will have a 
मोनोकार्पलरी सुपीरियर ओवरी दैट इज अ सिंगल कार्पल इन वन फ्लॉर हाउ एवर इन आर पटेटो फैमिली इन द गिवन फ्लॉर वी विल हैव बाय कार्पलरी कंडीशन दैट इज दे आर गोइंग टू बी टू कार्पल्स सो वी हैव डिस्क्राइब्ड ऑल द फोर सो वी डिस्क्राइब्ड ऑल द फोर वर्ल्ड एंड द सिमेट्री ऑफ द फ्लॉर्स सो सेमी टेक्निकल डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ दीज फ्लॉर्स इज कंप्लीट एंड वेन वी लुक एट द फ्लोरल डायग्राम विच इज एक्चुअली अ डायग्रामेटिक ऑफ दीज कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ओनली वी विल सी हाउ द डिफरेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ द प्लांट हाउ द मोफोलॉजी ऑफ द डिफरेंट फ्लोरल पार्ट्स हैज बिन रिप्रेजेंटेड हेयर वी कैन सी द सेपल्स विच आर यूनाइटेड टूगेदर दे आर ज्वाइंट टूगेदर इन द पी फैमिली आफ्टर दिस वी कैन सी द यूनिक एस्टिवेशन of the petals as well then our stamens that is our androecium we can see diadelphous condition one is separate rest nine are joined together and in the middle we can see our superior monocarpellary ovary similarly when we see at the floral diagram of our potato family of the makoi plant we see our calyx and corolla we see how there are five stamens and how they have been joined to the petals epipetalous condition and also here we can see the bicarpellary condition of our ovary so in this way we can describe flowers when we use a diagram to describe them it's called floral diagram when we use symbols it's called a floral formula and using these tools when we can describe the morphology of flowers belonging to different families of क्लास सिक्स टू ट्वेल्थ से लेके नीट आई आई टी जे मेन्स और एडवांस के लेवल तक 10 मिलियन से ज्यादा स्टूडेंट्स का भरोसा आज ही डाउनलोड करें डाउट नेट आप या व्हाट्सएप कीजिए अपने डाउट्स आठ चार सौ चार सौ चार सौ पर